Hello everyone and welcome back to Wolf Quest. And I do apologize if my voice is a little bit weird right now. It is really late at night for me and uh, my, my voice is kind of shot right now, but I'm going to do the best I can to get these episodes out uh, despite having a little bit of a crazy day. So we are here with Aurora, Borealis, Storm, Quartz, and Trot. And so far so good. Everyone's doing pretty well. Um, we did lose one pup to the cold early on, but, uh, today actually was not a freezing day, which is very, very good. So we're going to get everybody up. I'm actually just going to grab Trot and come up to the water here. And uh, we'll get ready to run across, so hopefully Borealis will prepare to bring the others as well. So let's see. Let's go ahead. We'll shift into a run, and then we'll dart across with Trot here. Okay. Oh, man, it's a little spooky because Aurora is so small that she tends to drop puppies into the water even as she's running. But uh, so far, so good. I think everything's going to be all right. So where is the next carcass? The carcass is over here. Let's head this way. And uh, Borealis should bring the other puppies as well. So here we go. Uh, we'll let these guys catch up, and then we'll probably get moving on ahead without Storm, because hopefully Borealis will just pick Storm up and carry him to us if we're far enough away. Hopefully. Oh yeah, and let's zoom out too. Uh, this is what is probably going to be the last day of our journey, so hopefully all goes well. Let's keep it moving. It's probably best to let Borealis carry most of the puppies, since we know that Aurora is so small that she tends to... Did you just leave Storm? She does tend to, um... Are you kidding? Are you gonna go... Can you go get Storm? Go get Storm, please. Or don't. Okay, fine. I'll go grab Storm. Um, but she does tend to not be able to hold the puppies out of the water. She can barely keep her own head out of the water. Um, alright, there comes Borealis. Uh, but yeah, so it's probably best to let Borealis carry the puppies because he is a little bigger. Let's see, where are these guys? They're right here. Let's make sure we feed everybody. And that should go well, I hope. Yes, there we go. Everybody's fed. Let's, uh, let's make sure we eat, and then we'll set out for that other carcass. It's probably not going to be a long episode today. Uh, we do have these, uh, these guys almost all the way there already. Borealis, you're not really helping. Oh, okay, you're sort of helping. <laughs> um, I was gonna say, you're pushing them further away, but, uh, he was going to carry, not just feed. So, uh, yeah, probably not gonna be a super long episode, and uh, we should be able to reach the rendezvous site fairly quickly, but hopefully nothing will happen on the way. So, let's head this way, and oh my goodness, uh, we got a new Wolf Quest, uh, uh, preview basically another one of those uh, weekly development update things today and oh my goodness if you guys haven't seen the video for that it's great <laughs> I, I'm not going I'm not gonna spoil it but oh my goodness I got a really good laugh out of it uh, so yeah make sure you go watch that if you have not already uh, sometimes uh, sometimes new features don't always go quite as planned it seems uh, that's basically how any sort of a coding will go uh, sometimes the results are unintended, and some of the time those unintended results can be quite hilarious. So, uh, yeah, that is a, uh, that, that is quite a fun thing if you guys haven't seen it yet. Um, if you guys have seen it, <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. Oh, goodness. I really like how they give us these development logs, though, too. It does help us to see the progress as they're working on this, and it, it just helps keep the excitement up, too. I, I certainly am a very excited for the coming, uh, the coming updates. We'll feed the others as they get closer, I think. I kind of fed Trot early there. What? No, 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 that is a fox. Oh, that is a fox. Okay, we have to chase it and try and kill it. All right, let's chase it back towards the puppies and see. We did manage to kill a fox last time, but uh, I don't know if we'll be able to do it again. Uh, we have a, an annual challenge this year. That means that uh, basically there are too many foxes, and we have to um, we have to try and chase them for a reasonable amount of time or kill them if we can because there's too many and they're eating everything. And we did actually see an uncommon number of foxes here. I think that's going to be enough. We've chased quite a bit, 
So uh, let's get the puppies over here. And if that fox comes back, we'll chase it again. Um, we don't have to kill them if we can't catch them in a reasonable amount of time, but we have to at least give it a good shot. Uh, but that fox will get to go free for now. Um, unless- oh, that is an eagle. Why am I stuck feeding? Okay, no, I was- I was just <laughs> stuck feeding for a short amount of time there. I don't know where the eagle's shadow is. I don't see it. I think it might be leaving. Normally it screams again if it's not leaving. Alright, let's keep everybody close if we can. So far, so good. I think we're good. Is that fox coming back? I don't see it. Let's just keep heading back towards the rendezvous site here. Uh, it's not that far off. <laughs> oh boy, we are almost there, you guys. And uh, once we finish with this, we'll be heading in to our second litters for both wolves. So we'll be starting with Knight again and watching his second litter. And then we'll be rejoining Aurora in another week. So uh, let's keep these guys moving. I think everything seems all right for the time being. Yes, I hope. This is going to be a really short episode. <laughs> uh, possibly the shortest Wolf Quest episode you that we have ever seen. And uh, oh, you guys, um, I found old footage from season three that was never released. I found uh, I found some footage for um, like I, f I found old behind the scenes footage of setting up for some of season three. Oh no, the fox is back. We have to chase it again. I don't think, oh man, we almost got the chance to bite it there, but we missed it. I don't think it actually will uh, attack our puppies though, so we should be okay in that respect. All right, come on. I would say we probably don't have to chase it quite as long this time. We're all the way up at the rendezvous site here. Oh, we got close enough to see the bite head for a minute there. Nope, we're not gonna make it. We're gonna have to go back to these guys. Um, but I actually found old behind the scenes footage from that. <laughs> uh, believe it or not, I have old footage from that and I will be releasing that soon. Uh, it is gonna re release first on the Patreon. So if you guys are, uh, if you guys end up supporting me on Patreon, you will get early access to that, but I will eventually release it on the channel as well here. Uh, for those of you guys who are interested, oh my goodness, I was watching through it though, and that was back with my old mic, and I, I it was a long time ago, and it, it was back from, it's been probably six months since season three. So, or near six, well, maybe not quite six months, but five or six months. Uh-oh. Um, okay. We've got to watch where it's going. Is it leaving? It's leaving. Okay. Let's get these guys up here. But yeah, so you keep your eyes out for that. It'll be releasing first on Patreon and then eventually here as well. Oh, Borealis, please come back. Please come back. Now is not a good time for this. All right. Let's keep everybody here. Everyone's here except for Borealis. Come on. We're so close. Here we go. Yes, so all three are safe. Aurora's first litter was overall a success, even though we did lose one puppy to the cold. Three of the four made it, and these guys will go on to be uh, eligible for air selection. So uh, make sure, um, well, I mean, it's not time to vote yet, I guess, uh, but uh, we, we will be heading back into the, um, we'll be heading back into the second litter for these guys next week, starting with night, and then the week following that, we will be rejoining Aurora. So keep your eyes out for that. Uh, anyway, this concludes the first litter of season four. I hope you have enjoyed. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you guys next time. But until then, this is Jay, over and out.